Again. It's just like back in middle school. I'm sorry. I'm not your personal. Nice work. I owe you one. What do you need? What are you up to? Back off! Now that you mention it, yeah, there is something I need help with. I lost my phone charm. It's in the shape of a cat. I know that I lost it somewhere in the hedge maze, but I don't want to go back in there. It's scary. I'm worried I'll get lost and be stuck in there for hours. I feel bad for asking, but would you be willing to go into the hedge maze and get my phone charm for me? Really? You'll do it? You're a lot more brave than I am. Good luck! Don't get me wrong. Looks are everything. Oh. oh my gosh! You actually found it! Wow, that's amazing! Thank you so much! Huh? What? Maybe I should meet... You're the one who wanted to meet me? Your note said that you wanted to talk about... blackmail? Yes. I heard you talking with your friend. I know that you have a stalker. And I know that he's blackmailing you. No, you've got the wrong idea. I mean... Yeah, someone is stalking me, but... He's not blackmailing me. Then... Why don't you call the police? He's got a hostage. He's threatening to harm them if I go to the cops. What? Who is being held hostage? I know you're not going to be able to take me seriously after you hear this. It's my cat. 
my pet cat. He kidnapped her, and he said he's gonna kill her if I call the police. He says that if I want my cat back, I have to go to his house. But I know that if I step foot inside of his home, he won't let me leave. Has he given you his address? Well, yes, but... Tell me where he lives. Why? What are you planning to do? I'm going to rescue your cat. What? Don't try it! He's a dangerous person! So am I. You don't know what you're getting yourself into! Just hand over his address and let me handle it. Fine. I just want this horrible experience to end, one way or another. I'll text you his address. Thank you. But don't blame me if you get hurt. And don't let anything happen to my cat! Don't worry. Leave it to me. Where did I put that cake mix? Oh, Miyuki, my love, my queen, my goddess. I knew you were real. I knew you existed somewhere in the real world. I knew we'd finally be together one day. That girl is the conduit. The way you will enter this world. If she dyes her hair and wears the right clothing, I'll be able to hold you at last. It's really going to happen. You will be mine. You will belong to me. I will possess you. I will own all of you from the top of your head to the bottom of your feet. With nothing left out in between. <laughs> oh my job and stay home all day long being a role model? Then where do we get the money to put food on our table, huh? I need to return your cat, and I need to have an important discussion with you. But it's too late at night right now. Please meet me at my house before school tomorrow. I will, and one last time. Thank you.
You have a nice place, Yanchan. Thanks. Where are your parents? Overseas. So you take care of yourself? That must be hard. I manage. I want to thank you again for rescuing my cat. And saving me from that stalker. That was a horrible experience. I'm so glad it's all over. The tea is ready. I'll be right back. Feel free to keep talking. I can't imagine what it's like to become obsessed with someone after meeting them for the first time. It doesn't make any sense. I'm shocked that there are people in this world who would actually be willing to harm a cat just to get what they want. That's insane! He said he loved me, but I don't think it was love. It was just a sick, twisted obsession that he believed was love. It makes me feel sick. But starting today, I won't have to worry about it anymore. It's all thanks to you. Here's your tea. Thank you. Oh, I just realized I've been rambling this entire time. You said you had something important to tell me, right? Yes. It's about the boy from Class 3, too. The boy you have a crush on. Huh? huh? I, I don't have a crush on him. He's just my childhood friend, that's all. I, I don't have feelings for him at all. If that's true, then you wouldn't mind if I confessed my love to him, would you? Huh? Confess your... love? Are you saying that you have feelings for him? Yes. Deep feelings. I've never felt this way about anyone before. And I can't bear the thought of seeing him with anyone else. I know that you love him. And I know that this is a selfish request. But please, don't take him away from me. Let me try to win his heart. You got me. It's true. I do have feelings for him. But... After everything you've done for me... I could never take someone away from you. Okay. I'll do as you've asked. I'll stay away from him. Thank you. But you'd better take really good care of him, okay? Don't worry. I will. In this world who would actually be willing to harm a cat just to get what they want. That's insane. He said he loved me, but I don't think it was love. It was just a sick, twisted obsession that he believed was love. It makes me feel sick. But starting today, I won't have to worry about it anymore. It's all thanks to you. Here's your tea. Thank you. Oh, I just realized I've been rambling this entire time. You said you had something important to tell me, right? Yes. It's about the boy from Class 3, too. The boy you have a crush on. Huh? I... I don't... I don't have a crush... on... Something's wrong. I feel so <sighs> sleepy. Why are you smiling? Huh? What is this? Why am I tied to a chair? Why are you doing this? 